This is Pritam once again and a few days ago and a viewer from my YouTube channel has asked me that um, how to make that PCV valve PCP valve for ear gun uh, this this ear guns I, I was talking about yes you can watch this power and testing of the ear gun in a in the next video in the next video of mine check out my channel so he asked me to show me how to build one yes um, now I will show you some diagrams put this aside yeah, there you go these are the main diagram principle I have uh, I have this there's one more video I have uh, posted in YouTube that showing the total, total principle of this valve so I will not go deep through I will go over and over the systems okay start yeah there is the stem there is the striker rod the striker pin then return spring this one then is the valve and thing the main thing is that uh, the, the this chime, uh, system is closed and there's a HPA high pressure here in there and this is this is the, the cock is shut by the spring and not air will not flow through it so the hammer strike on the spin the uh, the um, valve opens and then the air passes through it. This is the main principle. So if you want to watch the how does the the full things of this system, you can watch my uh, another video. Okay. But uh, for this, um, it's, um, for now, I will not um, talk much further. So let's begin. So these are the parts I am using for my valve. This is the main thing. This is this is aluminium tube which can support when much further PSI so uh, this is my things uh, your guys the main thing is that for making a PCV valve uh, guys we have you have to be creative suppose you don't have that parts uh, along with you so you need to be creative and find some scrap parts to make that valve so find your backyard your home for PCP related valve related parts and there should be a tube a PCB or aluminium aluminium will be better because it will hold more more PSI or pressure so and and a um, hot glue stick because this, this is like kind of a rubber so this can become the cork of the um, this one to to it will uh, shut down the entry this one this port this port shut the so that the air cannot pass through so you can use this one or this this rubber I have scrapped this out from a old printer, a uh, um, inkjet printer. This is the roller. So you can actually, if you don't use this, oh yes, um, main thing is that if you make a small valve, then you can use this one for a so small um, suppose of pistol. But if you want to make this kind of big one, we have to use this because it is more stiffer and harder. So it is very good okay main, is, main thing is that main thing is that um, we have to make a hole in here that is the exhaust port guys and you have to I am using this gear because if you use a, use a uh, small valve then you can actually put this this striker rod I am using this rod as a striker rod and it will stop look the strikers can move but this thing will stop the air leaking out from backside because it has very small hole inside it so you can sorry uh, 
you can use this over here yes here like this is that port yes there you go this one like this and and I have cut down this hot, hot tube glue tube glue like this this one this this is the very good surface for for no, not letting the air flow it can actually like this put this rod through this put this rod through this this glue stick and put the rod through this now the glue stick will be or glue stick will be sitting like this and the pin will be sitting like this so that is the simplest thing of the PCP air valve yes, there you go so now when the striker will uh, strike on this pin this will push the pin and it will move this hot um, stopper or stopper stopper cork outside and the air will flow through this tube and will then come out there you go eh, there you go come from the, here so this is the rough sketch I, uh, I, I am telling about so but you can understand that what I am meaning to so this is a small one but suppose we want to make make this one this type of figure gun then we have to use PCV because not all of your air chamber has this uh, diameter like this to fit in so you can, uh, there suppose you do, your chair chamber diameter is um, bigger than this one then it, it will like this bigger and it will then not gonna fit then you have to use this one this PCV tube same thing just you have to make the same hole and match the hole in the in a correct straight manner yes the hole should be of this one and this one should be matched together there you go and yeah there you go yeah and now the use this one this tube this will like this yes there you go yes like this and this will be a striker well and um, this is the lo longer one but you can cut it chop it off and make a shorter of this and the main thing is that now look you have to seal seal this excessive gap by any adhesive you want i currently use m seal which is very good and currently in any hardware store i, I can found that pc uh, m seal which is actually a good um, but um, there are a lot more lot more better one but you can use m seal that will seal this ex excessive gapping from uh, fill this gap with pv um, m seal and from this side also and remember what I've told before the match this uh, hole and this hole should be matched together now when the this rubber will sit like this and then the air will not through will be uh, pushed by a spring against this tube and you, the air will not flow so now when the striker pin hit this one it will open and the air will flow through this gap there you go this gap and flow out from here actually this um, this port should be on here but 
you can understand that it will go through this hole and come out through the barrel and through the barrel it will go out taking the bullet with it to throughout the barrel so there you guys um, how to make a PCV valve or striker valve or cricket valve for any ear gun any PCP ear gun because using a ball valve is not that efficient because we have to you have to pump harder and harder uh, to get uh, to get only one shot out of it and that is waste of energy and time it is much better way by you think now you think that uh, and we are pumping 30 times and getting one shot which is better pumping pumping 30 30 times and getting one shot or pumping 30 times or getting 15 or 16 shots i suppose 16 will be better so that's why a pcv valve is very important so this is the way you can make a pcv valve you can actually uh, the the main thing is that you have to be creative depending what what stuff you have around your house or using how how um, household items to make that valve you should be creative so thank you for watching um, please subscribe or or like if you like the video or if you have any queries uh, please comment thank you for watching bye